now with our favorite newly engaged couple, the Bachelors, Nick and Vanessa. And, um, you know, earlier, Nick, we showed a message from your parents. And, Vanessa, we know you're a special education teacher, and we got a little surprise message for you as well, for both of you. Check this out. And it, it, and it was great that you took Nick actually to your class to meet your students. And uh, we both, you, we know you're both out in LA now. And Nick, you're doing Dancing with the Stars. So first of all, yes. how is that going? And secondly, what are you gonna do after that Dancing with the Stars is over? Yeah, um, every part of my body hurts. Uh, <laughs> it's it's very hard. Uh, but but Pete has been great, and so I'm just trying to keep up with her. But um, yeah, I'm excited about that. But afterwards, even right now. Um, Recently started a uh, internet business for men's grooming supplies called the Polish Gent, which I'm very excited about. So I'm even focusing on that right now, um, even though I am doing dancing. But uh, that has been a big, uh, big priority for me uh, for the past several months now. Well, I gotta say, I do have a beard envy as I look at you. And um, oh, thank you, Michael. <laughs> and, a, and a question I think everybody wants: What about the wedding plans? Have you have you guys set a date yet? No, we're not. No, no. Um, like I said, I mean, like one thing I think we really appreciate about our, rela our relationship is we're we're going to take this one step at a time and be realistic. I mean, uh, last night, since we didn't make the flight, was our first time having dinner at a restaurant in public. Mm -hmm. And I think there's just some things we want to do as a couple and some normal things. And, you know, we're going to move things along. And so um, that's our focus right now. And, and we'll, we'll worry about setting a date down the road. Well, it's your, re it's your relationship. You handle it how you want to handle it. That's, that's your prior, uh, prior, prior, what do you call it, prerogative, Bobby Brown. Okay. We, we want to see how well you guys know each other. So we have a little game for you. The game is called Wedding Bliss or Total Miss. Now, now I'm going to ask both of you a question. You have a bouquet in the hand and you have a champagne flu in the hand. And if the question applies to um, Nick, you hold up the champagne glass. If it applies to Vanessa, you hold up the bouquet. And if you hold up the same thing, that means wedding bliss. You're both on the same page. If not, it's called wedding miss, okay? So here we go. Question number one, who has the shorter attention span? I mean, I... Well, you know, Nick, you know what I love? You're already looking at her for the answers. You're just, you're not even, don't go against her. You're, you're learning really early. Okay, it looks like you both agree. That's wedding bliss right there. Second question, who spends more time on his or her phone? There we go. You're, you're all on the same page. And here's the last one. Who usually wins an argument? Nick, look at Vanessa and learn. I would say both. We compromise. <laughs> well, you know what? I, I love that answer. It's all about compromising. And congratulations to both of you. Nick, good luck on Dancing with the Stars and with your business. Thank you very much. Vanessa, congratulations to you, too. Thank you. We'll be keeping an eye, and I'm sure we'll talk to you guys soon.